May 23, 2022, the morning planets, Venus, Jupiter, Mars, and Saturn, and the Moon appear as celestial stepping stones across the river of morning twilight. Chart Caption, 2022, May 23rd, four morning planets and the Moon are in the eastern sky before sunrise. By Jeffrey L. Hunt. Chicago, Illinois, Sunrise, 5.24 a.m. CDT, Sunset, 8.12 p.m. CDT. Check local sources for sunrise and sunset times for your location. Notice that the length of daylight is approaching 15 hours at this latitude. Total twilight, before sunrise and after sunset, lasts 4 hours, 4 minutes. That leaves less than 6 hours for total darkness. Twilight lengthens during the summer season in the northern hemisphere. The sun is farther north in the sky and takes longer to reach the angle at which the sky grows dark. Twilight occurs when the sun is within 18 degrees of the horizon. Morning Sky The four bright morning planets, Venus, Jupiter, Mars, and Saturn, and the Moon are spaced across the eastern sky during morning twilight. The Moon first attracts our attention. Only 43% illuminated, the lunar orb is 20 degrees up in the southeast. Saturn is 15.9 degrees to the upper right of the thick lunar crescent, while bright Jupiter is 22.4 degrees to the Moon's left. Look for dimmer Mars, 3.5 degrees to the right of the Jovian giant. Mars passes near Jupiter in a week. Watch the red planet get closer each morning. Morning star Venus is nearly 9 degrees up in the east and 21.6 degrees to the lower left of Jupiter. Venus is quickly stepping eastward away from the other three planets. The bright morning planets span 58.8 degrees from Venus to Saturn. The Moon catches Venus in four mornings. A thin lunar crescent appears only 3.6 degrees from the brightest planet. Start at Venus and step to each planet and the Moon as you would to cross a creek. Mercury passed its inferior conjunction two days ago. It is moving into the morning sky, but it rises at about the same time as the Sun. Later next month, Mercury joins the current morning planet quartet along with the Moon. Evening Sky Chart Caption, 2022, May 23rd, Arcturus and Spica are in the southern sky after sundown. Notice their contrasting star colors. Step outside after nightfall. Two bright stars, Arcturus and Spica, are in the southern sky. Notice their contrasting colors. Arcturus is topaz in color, while Spica is sapphire. The contrast in star colors indicates they have different temperatures. Arcturus is the second brightest star visible from the mid-northern latitudes and the brightest in the northern half of the sky, north of the celestial equator, the extension of Earth's equator into the sky. The star is nearly 40 light years away from Earth, and it shines about 100 times brighter than our Sun. Spica is the tenth brightest star visible from northern latitudes. It is 250 light years away, shining with a brightness of nearly 2,000 stars equal to the brightness of our central star. Contrary to artistic interpretations of color, blue is hotter than red-orange when comparing stellar characteristics. Arcturus color indicates a temperature around 8,000 degrees Fahrenheit, while Spica's is about 40,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Each inch two of the visible surface of Arcturus releases less energy than the Sun and Spica. In comparison to Spica, a shovel full of Arcturus is darker than Spica's surface. Interestingly, Arcturus is a larger star than Spica. Arcturus is 12 times larger than the Sun while Spica is 2.5 times bigger, that's the diameter. The cooler and redder a star, the larger it must be to acquire significant brightness. Bright blue stars are not very large in comparison. During this season, take a look at this stellar pair and note their contrasting colors.